That's the backpack on the move. Baby butler over there in the dark. And Christine the butler. Yes, we have snow also. It's been two weeks and five days and I had my second knee replacement on the same knee. So yeah, I'm hobbling along. Had a call come in last minute today and we're super booked out, the guys are. And I may be doing something I shouldn't be doing as much, but we got over 10,000 square feet of carpet to pull off tonight in this convention center and restaurant bar. I think it's gonna hurt. I'm gonna go at it. And they were supposed to have a crew here to help pick up stuff. Got the sound panels and the panels between rooms put away. That was an adventure. Oh, wrong door, or it locked on me. It locked on me. Just what I need, more steps, which I don't need. So I'll go in the front here again. I'm getting to a point, I might get a potty mouth by the end of this tonight. There's the culprit. This is about 7,500 square feet just in itself. Bar, restaurant in there, and the other side dining room. There's supposed to be people here to uh, remove that. So he's got those tables and chairs moved over so he can do that section. There's a lot of moving junk here. Aaron's out on the other side. I'm just getting hose in and I shouldn't dilly dally too much because it's only about 20 degrees outside and eh, it can take some time, but it'll start freezing up if I'm not careful. So Aaron's coming in through a window in there. Haven't got a name for that new one yet. If y'all got an idea, what I should call it. The last one was Fred. Fred, Fred made me very angry. Fred was a bad me. All right. Code red with a volcano going. Great, great. I'm gonna say that way. Let's try it. This is gonna be a long night of 7,500 square feet, I'll tell you. All right, see this? That foam in there? That's the oxygen in there being released, the powdered oxygen. So, and I didn't leave it a lot of room in there because I got 7,500 square feet, so I squeezed a whole bunch of muster in there, you could say. My zipper's over here. Well, I'm gonna go back over that direction and I'm gonna start cleaning. So I'm pulling from that direction and away from my hose. So I've free sprayed up to that wall there, greenish and halfway to those middle doors. Feel that thunder. Oh, turn it on, Mark. No thunder making happen in there. And I gotta get this away from my knee or I'm gonna be screaming the whole dang night with that thing touching it. Don't touch, bad touch. All right, let's try this again. Oh no. This, uh, this isn't fun. <laughs> okay. Oh. Yep. Maybe a little early. Just a tad bit early. Maybe. I've never been a quitter. This week. It's only Monday. Oh my gosh. Anybody have a wheelchair they can lend me? Electric, scootered? I'll just sit and push and pull. Piece of cake. It's like walking the dog. Except the dog would be pulling me. Said I'm pulling this. Feels like Tanya Harding's been here. My knee, kind of feels like it. There's something in there. Nope, we're good. This is absolutely gonna be a long, long night. what I get myself into? A little behind the wheel. Piece of cake. All right, so I took those two stacks, that's chairs. That's my line up to that door. And that corner is there. So then what I did, 
sprayed up to that window curtain there. So I'm gonna do all of this. Now normally, I'd wanna keep going the same direction I was just going because carpets will sometimes show when you're changing the direction. This carpet, it's not gonna matter. So I'm gonna go from there up to there. And then I'm again pulling my hose and working my way away from my hose over there. I wonder if they got something to drink out there in this soda section. I'm thirsty. What you got? Going along well, here? 10,000 more square feet. And, uh, I hear you. Probably another hour over here, hour and a half over here for me. Okay. He's, huh. he's got one pass left in there and then he's busting. Really? There. Well, that's good news, actually. Yeah. I just can't move fast. I'm thirsty, though. Wonder if they got a soda drink up there at the main office desk if somebody's there. I'm going to go see if I got some because I feel like I've been licking somebody's tires outside my <laughs> yuck from all the medicine. Did you? Yeah. Well, you were forward thinking. I'm in the reverse mode yet. <laughs> How's it going in here, Brady? It's going. You're just about done in here, I hear, huh? Yeah, I just cut this last pass over. Okay, well, that's cool. I'll let you go. I'm going to go see if I can find something to drink. Feel like I've been licking somebody's tire. Rockstar, boom. The new code red. Let's see how it goes. Make sure you get all my nose hairs in there, too. Oh, man, I need a good kick. Mmm. Does take like, tastes like whipped strawberry. <sighs> Let's hope. <sighs> I don't got it in it for the Rockettes tonight. I'm gonna have to do this by hand. There. Strongman competition next. Got some good stains in here too. Oh, that goes. Oh, that's no rocket move. Ain't gonna lie, that hurts. That just plain hurts. Some people ask, Mark, isn't that hard on your zipper wand when you slam it to the floor? Nope. Nope, you could fall off a truck on a highway. It'll dent the pavement before it probably hurts the zipper. So well built it is. Enforcements. There comes Brady, BG. Thank goodness. Yeah, I'm sitting down on the job. I am, uh, I'm trying though. Uh, me and my Zoom. Anyway, my little zipper, we're getting it done. Slowly though. Whew. Feel the burn, they say. Boy, did I have a PT session this morning too. Had a new gal doing PT. She was actually very good, by the way. She definitely earned her money. <laughs> Stretched it out really good, got me, I mean, it, it needed to be done. <sighs> Almost should request her again next time this week. I mean, I keep thinking it was, I'm doing this video, it's close to uh, Veterans Day and I keep watching and seeing these veterans, World War Ones, Twos, that, you know, you see them in wheelchairs and stuff. There was one quote somewhere too on the internet where you see these people and somewhere at some time they were badasses. And so young men that went and did what they did. So I always keep in mind that I, I just need to push through things too. Just one of those things, I, even when I was teaching, I was teaching my kids how to get through things, be better, get yourself better. I'm gonna get through this pain. I'm slow tonight. It does make me a little frustrated, but I'm just uh, giving a little rest here and uh, I'm gonna go. I mean, I'm just not gonna quit. <laughs> okay, maybe I'll cry. <laughs> Potatoes. Hey, there's some good eating. That was just gum. I don't want that tonight. Except I still feel like I've been licking a tire. Medications have been on. Pretty simple stuff now. Haven't taken pain meds in a week. 
Then I'm gonna take one to sleep tonight though. This knee is gonna scream. You don't get off that floor. I'm gonna go get a spoon and take you off there and I'm gonna eat you up. Oh, stubborn. There. Wow. Huh. Mac and cheese. Full smorgasbord. Come on, Daddy. Let's go. So Brady just came in and was, I was working on a spot here. He says, are you okay? I said, yeah. Your face is telling you otherwise. <laughs> yeah, it was painful a moment. Whatever I was doing. I was probably trying to scoop some of the mashed potatoes off the floor. There we go. Come to Papa. How long is this? Let's start counting steps. Kind of like counting sheep though, I might go to sleep. Oh, you mashed potatoes sure are sticky around here. Add some more milk and butter, please. There you go. Whatever you were, holy smokes. Who is that, broccoli? Might be. Oh, I'm not eating that. <laughs> Unless it's got some cheese sauce on it. Deep fried. Well, that's the cauliflower. That'd be fine. Man, oh man, why am I picking such long, long passes tonight? So there was once a man from Nantucket. I don't know who he was though. I'm from Minnesota. Oh, come on. Now what are you? Seriously? <laughs> Give it up. Ah, just have to beat it up a little bit. What am running into here? Oh, a french fry. That's fair game. Nope. Wood chip. I'm just not a beaver today. A woodchuck, good chuck wood. Only about 10 more of these passes and I'll have this section done. Well, half of a third I'll have done. I wonder what Sally Rogers is up to. Okay, I've been down this strip. I didn't progress. I wasn't paying enough attention. Would you look at that? What type of snack cracker? Wow, well, you just a jumpy bugger tonight. Get in there. This is just painful. You're probably saying the same thing about the video. Oh, come on, Mark. <sighs> I used to like mashed potatoes. I even used to like some rice. Not tonight. See, another cheesy bit. Wow, just some tough, tough, tough eating here this evening. Yep. There to halfway over there. Whew, that's like an eternity. See that? That's a person with a good knee going at it. Oh yeah, he's got some mashed potatoes too. Mashed potatoes? Gum. Not sure. Probably mashed potatoes. That's it? That's a good It's awfully dark for mashed Oh no, that's just some spill. That's a rum and coke. Want me to taste it? I won't get back up though if I do. <laughs> could be the alcohol, could be the knee. <laughs> what do you got left, partner? This strip, this strip, and then in there where all my hose is. I just got this path though. Okay. I got underneath all the furniture in that corner down. So. Well, that's nice. So, where I'm sitting in your way and. You're going to sit just, you're out of the way. Whoo! Yeah. That's so thin over there. Okay. It's in rough shape. It is. It's the original carpet and it is pretty rough. Uh, there's is stuff 15, out there. 15 years old? Uh, probably at least, yeah. I was still teaching when this place opened up. I want to say 2006, maybe. Remember the first time we did it? We did everything. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that was after, day, after, I was a, hungover after a after a wedding. wedding. You didn't get in till like an hour or two before. Yep. And we did the whole stinking place. Had, Two of us. It was the most steps I ever had. It was 38,000 steps that day. Yeah, it was a it was a huge day. Like 15 miles or something. My phone said. Yeah, that would uh, no. I don't Back doubt it. Backwards. I don't know what my camera's set to. Just not kicking in. It's dark. Just dark. Dark, I tell you. Just dark. Huh? Oh, the settings on my camera might be wrong for this tonight, but. Clean it up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah. Oh yeah, there you go. Trying out for the Rockettes, right there. <laughs> Young and viral. Give her the kick. He's doing the Rockettes Christmas show. I'm back. The real Mark Zager, yeah. Yeah, that was an interesting story tonight, huh? Woo! Dude, you're killing it! Ow, that hurt uh, right in the knee. Oh, God. Ooh, wee. Oh, oh, about three passes left here. Three to go. Three. That did no good. And fell right out again. And there's gonna be two more passes. Don't know where all this garbage has come from all of a sudden. I can tell you, sure being a pain in the tushy. Yeah, it's noodles. And I let it go to waste. This could be my last pass. Maybe. You're gonna serve this many potatoes? Leave behind some gravy too. Come on, get out of there. Oh, you're painting the tushy. Oh, you're really stuck. He's drinking on the job. <laughs> yeah. What are you, uh, tick talking? No. <laughs> so you're done in there? Not yet. Oh gosh. I'm finding a, a music station. To music listen. station to listen to. All right, well, while you're doing that, I'll go finish that half of that third, whatever that is. You do math? I'm not doing the math. 2,300 square feet. Yeah, I think it is more than that, but maybe you're right. Ah, dang it, 3,000. Well, while I'm sitting here trying to recover, let's just watch Brady work. He pre sprays that section. Yeah, he's doing a pretty good job. A lot of rock star boom. I got no boom boom left. The boys are tired. They're feeling it. Just at an end of day, just pulling these dang hoses kills a person. Do you want to uh, maybe take this section over in here between these two walls? And then we can get these tables moved into there and moved over there and over there. Yeah, do that area there. I've got remaining from where I'm at, the curtain to the wall. The guys are just telling me for their steps for today. Aaron has got 18,740 some, and Brady G is trying to tally it up. Just remember, we're now at about 11.30, and 30 more minutes you'll run out, so if you're gonna get to 20,000, we better hustle. Ready? Rockettes, ain't happening. <laughs> Hell oh, yeah, baby. Feel the burn. Good grief, I feel like I'm pushing a wall right now. It's, it's burning. I'm feeling it pretty, pretty strong now. Well, my watch is telling me, get this, this is kind of crazy, I didn't expect it. I'm almost at 10,000 steps today. Oh, no wonder I hurt. If I'm gonna hit 10,000, I better get busting tail. I got 20 minutes until it's midnight. And we just gotta start all over for the day. It's an insane accomplishment. Well, I just ran out of water and I got that. Oh, that much in that corner left. The guys are there. They're getting low on water too. We're low on energy. All right, I'll go find water. Well, crapola. I don't think I'm gonna find anything out here. Maybe there's something over by the restaurant part. It's been a long time since I've been out here, and of course, I really don't wanna fall in this either. It wouldn't be good. Oh my gosh, snow, debris. Oh, let's go try the front. All three vans huddled up. I'm gonna kinda of have to hurry up too, or my high pressure line is gonna freeze up on me, sitting there. That creates another predicament with no moving water. And then in Minnesota, find an outdoor spigot that's still turned on and or not frozen and gonna cause trouble. Gosh, that's a whole nother adventure. 
All right, boys, closest water is in there in the sink. I'm gonna go hook up some hoses and see if I can get, nah, I can't get anything outside. Everything's not working out there. So I'm gonna run a hose in here, go out there down that hall and- We're just talking. Yeah. Brady would like Peter Grigg to do a review on him. Huh, Peter Grigg. <laughs> We'll get some video of I work with your buddy Aaron. Yes. Creme de la creme. Creme de la creme. That's Brady G. Oh, it's a trap. It's a trap. All right. So out of all that ring of all these, I have to find all one that'll fit and make it work. This will be fun. All right, found an adapter and I got myself a gasket. Got this clippy clip on. Got my hose hooked onto it. Yeah, baby. All right, let's stretch her out and make her go. Not leaking, that's a good sign. That one's open and going. Yay, I got water and I got a splitter here, boys. Hey. Yo, let me go get the machine revved up one more time. Let's hope I didn't freeze up by this point or all of this is futile. Oh, that hurt. All right, let's go, Christine, make some power. Let's get angry. He is moving everything, burying in, just like a bull, strong like bull. <laughs> Well, here's hoping, guys, that it didn't freeze up in that time. Hey! Hey! I got H2O, baby! I got some cheesy potatoes here, too. Dang it! Should have brought a fork. Because I didn't have to put the fork in me yet. Not done. Just lightly browned. Some more potatoes. Too strong like bulls. Very, very strong. These guys are setting up, finishing in here, but they're low on water. So that's another thing we gotta get done. Get some more water, blah, 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 yada, yada. Yeah, and there they go. Taking it up to the chair. Going to the chair. Going to the chair. Done yeah, I hear you. All I can know is the sooner we're done here, the sooner we all go home. We'll get a few hours of sleep and be back. Yeah, a few hours and hit her again, god dang it. Well, back to my corner I must go. All right, so all we got left is that little far corner up to where Brady and Aaron are. So how much water you got left out there? What's Aaron's got? Go ahead, Aaron, hook up, start using mine. I'm filling up with water. Now 12.35 a.m. Whoo, doggy. Ain't this living, boys. Clearing hoses, getting down to one. All right, I'll go start wrapping also. Oh, yeah, I know. Nice maze. <laughs> yeah, this obstacle course was set up just and just for me. It's training. Okay, We've got two of them going yet. I've got the backpack wrapped up. Going to town. Tag teaming. Whew, steaming up my glasses. My contacts probably ain't coming out of my eyes. They've been in too long, they're well in there. So in about four hours, even including moving a ton of furniture, stuff out in the dining rooms, and just even having to take down all of these big, long, tall partitions, 
uh, four hours for, uh, it's over 10,000 square feet. It's could be pushing 12,000, so uh, we're whooped. And then they gotta be up soon again. It started all over again tomorrow. I haven't even looked at the schedule, but I think it's another full one. It's been insane, insane. Wrapping up hide hoses, wrapping up zippers. I gotta go get this hose undone in the kitchen. And we'll probably have to let somebody know at the front desk we're done. This is definitely sore. Let's get loading up. All right, guys, thanks again. Oh, yeah. I'll just... Well, apparently my camera ran out of battery just as I was doing the wrap-up with the boys. But I really want to thank the guys for all their hard work. They put in a long day that day. And then again, the next day, incredibly long day. I was pretty wiped out myself. I was even feeling lucky that I could do what I did. I actually improved on my knee at physical therapy today. But, boy, I was wiped out for a day and a half. So thanks again for checking us out. Check out the channel. Subscribe if you would. We enjoy all of your comments and likes and shares. And look forward to seeing you in the next one. <laughs> Did you miss me? Did you? You missed me. Do you got a squirrel? Where's your squirrel? There's your squirrel. You got another squirrel? What do you, which squirrel are you going to take to bed? What? Which one? Oh, you can't decide. makes these videos to showcase his team at Sager Steam Clean. You love gum, don't you? Love but Mark Sager is also trying to clean up messes left behind when someone pretends to be him. So a week or two ago, there was one out there using uh, pictures, a uh, variation of my name. It's been going on for years on both Facebook and Instagram. And unfortunately, I'll even report it to Facebook that somebody using it and it's not, you know, whatever the box or whatever out there are saying, no, it's... It's not. This is okay. It doesn't go against our standards and guidelines. He's gotten some culprits to stop. He's also posted on social media about this saga to warn friends and family. If you see someone using my pictures, using my profile, please report it. Because it's not funny at all when people say they've gotten swindled out of money or built a relationship with someone using his face. Fortunate conversations about money exchange or really hurt feelings. Um, both of those are really terrible. I mean... There's so much going on in the last few years, the last thing we need is any of that. For his part, Sager is trying to keep a sense of humor about it. As far as using my profile and stuff, it's like, hey, really? <laughs> Come on, this face? Come on, I've gotten to the point now, I just go make comments on the page with Bill Costas and darn good looking guy you got there. We spoke to an attorney here in Duluth, Jim Baller, and he said if someone says something about you in a public space, it is actionable. And if someone is misusing Mark's image, he could make a case for defamation, but this is kind of new territory in the legal world. And sometimes just the threat of a lawsuit is enough to get people to stop. For now, this real Mark Sager just keeps standing up for himself on his second brand new knee. With you on social media, I'm Renee Cassall for WDIO News. So, thanks Renee Strange. Well, the Gooseberry River is...